Hi, this is Sam Botstein for TractorSkills.com. Make sure to subscribe to us on YouTube for all of our tractor tutorials and check us out at TractorSkills.com. In today's tutorial, we're going to take a quick look at how to use Tractor's preparation playlist. Essentially, when you're just browsing in Tractor, you have the ability to load tracks into any of the four decks. There are shortcuts to do this on most controllers, and if you're using the standard keyboard mapping in Tractor, then when you just press shift and then the left or the right arrow, it'll load it into either the left or the right track, that's track A or track B. If you're going to be DJing a whole set, you know, in a real situation, it might be a lot better to spend more time DJing and less time in the browser trying to find your next tracks, or looking at the browser in between every track, or Worst of all, having your head stuck in the computer, which is sort of affectionately known as tractor face. So what I would recommend doing is either planning a little bit ahead of time, maybe you choose three songs at a time or something like that, or you could have a special playlist for your gig. Some people even use a playlist with special properties in Tractor called the preparation playlist. Essentially the way that this works is that you have in your browser a preparation playlist. It's also visible in your browser favorites, which is this sort of bar up here. You'll notice that the way that my layout works, when I press space, I sort of don't really see much of the browser at all. And when I press it again, I basically only see the browser. Everything's very minimized. So if you're not seeing this, I would recommend either trying to press space to switch your view, or you can open up Tractor's Preferences, go to Browser Details, and this option, Show Playlist Favorites, will toggle that. This gives you a nice shortcut. I always leave the Preparation Playlist accessible right there. So, if you take a look at any of your playlists, you'll be able to actually, just from the drop-down, add stuff to the Preparation Playlist. We could say, hey, let's put it right there. We could even add it to the, the preparation playlist and put it on the top. So you say add as next to preparation playlist. And you'll see that when we look back at this playlist, it's changed the order for us such that it did indeed put the track that I chose that second option for up on top. Now, in your preparation playlist, you can actually do it very sparingly like I did there, or you can add whole bunches of tracks at the same time. I could go ahead and take, you know, three-fourths of this playlist, and then add it to the next in the preparation playlist, and then it's all there. I mean, you can have as much or as little as you want. From there, you know, you have access to organizing by key or BPM, or even by genre, something like that, your comments, and this way you can sort of curate your collection very quickly on the fly. What's special about the preparation playlist, as opposed to any other playlist, in addition to this right-click drop-down, is in your preferences, in the controller manager, you can add to any mapping and in under browser, under list, that are those two options, append to preparation playlist or add as next to preparation playlist. This allows you from, say, your controller to without sort of taking your hands off of whatever you're doing, to quickly look through the browser, add things to the playlist. This is especially nice if you're a hardware-based DJ, if you're using a real mixer, like perhaps the Control-Z2, uh, or something like the Control-X1, the Control Effects and decks like that. This can be a nice thing. You can even map this switch here with touch-sensitive browsing. I'll show you how to do that. If you're using the X1 Mark II, there's this full browser on touch option. I actually typically use this off, but if you turn both of these things on, you'll be able to control pretty much everything you need in order to take a huge collection down to just a preparation playlist for your live DJ sets, all without ever touching your computer keyboard. Make sure to subscribe to us on YouTube for all of our tractor tutorials, and check us out at tractorskills.com.